Hey guys, um, today we're gonna try and learn to play Nothing Else Matters by Metallica. I'll first play the song and then break it down into different parts uh, for you guys to understand it. It's a pretty easy song, all you need to be um, good at is a decent amount of finger picking and if you're okay with that, then you should probably learn the song in like 15 minutes. So I'll play it and then you can check it out. Here it goes. Okay, so uh, now that you heard the song, let's get into playing it. Uh, first of all, let me make one thing clear. This might look a little funny. Uh, third fret, fifth fret, seventh fret, ninth fret, twelfth fret. The body of the bat indicates the fret number. So I hope that doesn't confuse you. Okay, anyway, to play the song, like I said, you need to finger pick. And the way I do it is I use my thumb for the low E string, A string, the D string. I use my index finger, my first finger for the G string, second finger for the B string, third finger for the high E string. Okay, the first part is very simple. You just go strings 6, 3, 2, 1, 2, 3, 6, 3, 2, 1, 2, 3. four times and if you notice carefully the fourth time I didn't end on the third string you end on the second string that's because the next part starts right after that so after that you have uh, the next part which you play with your ring finger your third finger is on the first string seventh fret you play the note twice and then you play second string and third string just after that so it goes get it just the third string just the third finger sorry third finger now after this you add your first finger on the second string fifth fret and now you play the first string pull off and then play the second string get it so you have play the sixth string and the third string again and after that you bring first finger to E string seventh fret and play seventh fret and then the eighth fret and then you play the seventh fret again hammer on on the eighth fret pull off back to the seventh fret so it's fifth then the fifth fret back to the 7th fret back to the 5th fret and then you slide out of the neck so it's get it? so what do we have so far? so far we have After this, you um, you play the fifth string and the first string together twice, just twice. Okay. Meanwhile, as you're doing this, you take your third finger and your pinky, and you place them. The third finger goes on the fifth fret G string, pinky goes on fifth fret B string, and your first finger goes on second fret first string okay so after you do after that place your fingers here and then you go 
third string second string first string pull off second string third string so you go you do this twice second string no first string and uh, fifth string place your fingers and then go 3 2 1 pull off 2 3 and then your first finger is taken off but your third and fourth finger are still in place then you do 5 3 2 1 2 3 you go 5 3 2 1 2 3 you play um you keep your thumb on the fifth string and you place all three fingers on the respective strings first finger g string second finger b string third finger um e string okay and then you play all of it these two fingers are still in place okay okay you played once add your then the second time you add your index finger on the second fret of the a string and then the third time you move it to the third fret of the a string so you have get it okay then you go again okay this is a little tricky this portion here you go 5 3 2 1 before you hit one before you hit the first string you need to bring your finger to the first string hold it there and when you hit one you supposed to do a pull off so it goes 5 3 2 1 5 3 2 1 2 3 5 3 2 1 2 3 So sorry, I made a mistake. Five, three, two, three, and then one. So it goes. Five, three, two, three, one, pull off. Five, three, two, three, one, pull off. And then you come back to the A string. Come back to first finger on the A string. Play all the strings together. A string, A string, and your three fingers here. Slide the whole thing. a whole step from a whole step and do the same thing 5 3 2 3 over here you hammer on and then pull off previously you did you played 5 3 2 3 you played the note on the e string and then did the pull off whereas now you play 5 3 2 three play the open string hammer on pull off and then again second string and third string then you again do or what you did in the beginning Six three two one two three six three two one two three. Except here, three two one is on harmonics. If you don't know how to play harmonics, it's very simple. Over the twelfth fret, over the twelfth fret, just over the metal mm. fret line. Don't go before the fret. Just over the fret line. P- just simply place your finger. Don't press. No pressure needed at all. Just place your finger over the string. and play the string very lightly you'll hear a harmonic that's how you play a harmonic so the last part of the song is just what you did originally except that on strings 1 2 3 you play harmonics instead so it goes 6 3 2 1 2 3 6 3 2 1 2 3 goes about it so um anyway i hope i hope some of this made sense to you um if you if you like this video please uh rate right down here 
Uh, give me your comments. I'd like to know if I'm a good teacher. Uh, well, if I'm not, I will try to improve the videos from now on. Um, anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you learned something out of it. I'll see you guys later.